hello everyone welcome back again so guys um you guys know that ever since many cut uh, lemon and uh, joy in that uh, last video i uploaded the other day um a lot of people have turned back against mary okay but they fail to understand that behind every action there is a reaction something prompts her to be so the reason i'm still standing for this lady here is mary wasn't like this before okay if don't worry i'm going to upload some old videos of she and her, her husband when they newly got married she was a loving person a very shy person she can't even face the camera but a lot of people will not see that part of her have you ever noticed some people you know everybody reacts differently so those things she's even saying she's the type that have she's a temperamental person maybe the temperamental person she's trying to you know um control it but there is something everybody still needs to understand she's still growing with time she will know how to control it more she just feel like let me just say it the way it is with me people like mary they don't keep things in heart they don't keep things they just say it how it is with them and then they let go what they just want is for you to understand so please if people are judging her try to still understand that at the time this girl wasn't like this this girl is pain she's frustrated she don't even know where to stand right now Anyway, guys, let me leave you all to watch what this lady actually said. Uh, please don't forget to drop your opinion in the comment section. And thank you so much. God bless you. Mary Rahim, I'm going to be talking to you as a sister. <laughs> Not just as a sister, maybe as even my child. Yes, because if I started giving birth to um, kids when I first saw my menses, maybe I should have a child of your age. Don't look at me that way. I know what I'm saying. I may not look it, but I know what I'm saying. And then, not just that, I'm talking to you out of experience. See, I am an Aries like you. I understand your temperament so well. I understand who you are because I am like you. So it's just like talking to my second self. When I was your age, I made a lot of mistakes. <laughs> I was dealt with emotionally, just like, maybe not exactly what you're going through, but, you know, similarly. So I understand perfectly what you're passing through. I understand how you love because that's how I love. That's how I raise love. I understand how you make decisions because that's how I used to make my decisions. I understand how you act because that's how I used to act. I understand how you speak. I understand your thought process. I understand visually everything because I am an artist like you. But I'm going to be helping you. I'm going to be very realistic and very raw. And if you listen to me, you're going to make the best decision of your life today. You're going to be very realistic in this decision. I'm not going to come out straight to tell you to take this decision or not, but I'm going to put lights, you know, to your eyes. Like I'm going to make it look real and then allow you to make your decisions. Listen, hello, Mary. One of the toughest things for an artist to do is to take decisions of the hearts like this, to say, I quit, especially when they love you. When an artist love you, they stick, they stay, even when they say they want to go, they don't mean it. They love to a fault. They love to stupor. They love you like crazy. They love you with everything in them. They don't mind giving up themselves just to love you. <laughs> but my dear, as I grew, I understood that those things were not meant, that were not the way they're supposed to be. That's not how we should love. When you are loving, you should consider yourself also while loving. You should love yourself so much because it's only when you love yourself so well that you can love another person. Yes. You should love yourself first. Love God, love yourself, than any other person. You can only take care of another person when you have taken care of yourself. You know, in as much as I see you come out and form boss lady and talk and do as if nothing the apple, nothing the shelly. My dear, you know sin a lie. It is shelly because I understand you. <laughs> it is shelly. I understand how completely you are down most times because of these things. How you cry, how you wet your pillows, how you, you know, at the outside, people see a strong person. Inside is a weak person that is going down every day emotionally being depressed and you know thinking of everything but yet comes out bold and strong and try to defend herself especially with her mouth make clarifications try to make everybody understand you say things online my dear this is not how this thing work you have to be real i have to be real i have to grow i have to train myself i have to you know train myself to be here so listen the truth is between these two things is either 
lemon does not love you. And that one is clearer to me because I see narcissism all over him. I see a narcissist playing. I see a core narcissist. See, when a narcissist try to come back to you, it seems as if it's love. That's not love. They just use you. They don't want another person to have you. And that's not love. Not wanting another person to have you is not love. That's jealousy. All he is doing is just not wanting another person to, you know, see your good side and then fall in love with you that's why he feels so jealous when you go out go out you feel so jealous when he seems another person wants to have you he's not just wanting you because he wants you he genuinely loves you but because he does not want it's about his ego it's about him it's about his selfishness he doesn't want to let you go it's not about you do you understand now i don't think he loves you and i know he does not but if you say he loves you he insists <laughs> then that means something is wrong somewhere that means I, I i think i need to believe what i saw on one blogger's um page she was trying to say this morning was it this morning or yesterday evening i don't know when she made that post that someone cut joy sakini going to the beach abbey river water size something like that to go make rituals um you know to go make rituals you know with lemons it was a picture and then he was told to put the picture in a in a can and throw it into the river and then wash her face five times or whatever. I am not supposed to mention names, but I want you people to go listen to her and hear what she said about this. She said, according to them, that she and the person in question that caught um, Joy doing this have evidences. That's Lady IB, Helping Hands, whatever, whatever. Those of you that know her page, go watch her video on this. She threw more light on it. Something like this. That's the day... Um, one of the days Joy said she was going to f going out for jeans. She wore black and black. She covered her face. She wanted to disguise what this girl, f you know, you know, f knew her and was started filming her. When she found out that somebody was filming her, she ran after the person and made sure that the person deleted it. Although the girl said she still have some left. Go and listen to her, the lady IB is on her video. Scroll and watch her say these things herself. So it, it will not be as if I'm saying. I'm just reporting what I heard on her page. Then if you say lemon loves, that means something is fishy somewhere. That means joy is using powers. Just like you have seen evidence on her you know, on most of the things she has done, you see her with candles, you've caught her with several things. So what? Hello? If you say lemon loves you, then that means there's Judy walking on lemon somewhere. And then that means you need to do something. You know, you need to do this. If you claim or know that deeply, deep down there, he loves you, then you need to visit a man of God, a strong man of God. I would recommend Pastor Bukobi because of, you know, how everybody have been going about, you know, talking about his things and how real he is. I'm not saying he's the only man of God, but it's rare to see true man of, men of God that will not just because of money deceive you, that are real, that will tell you how it is, what God said when he said it, without missing words, and people that can see clearly. So you need to be careful here, so that you are you are not being led, or you are not being, you don't fall into the wrong hands when you are choosing a man of God. So be careful. Make sure that this man of God is a real man of God. Then you go for that person, whoever you choose. But if I'm to recommend, I'll recommend Bodo Ebukobi or Pastor Ebukobi. You go use him, like talk to him, you know, like, get to meet him, anything, break, break protocols to meet him and talk to him and then reach out to him and then he will give you solutions. He will tell you what exactly God wants you to do at this point, whether to leave or to stay or to pray. If there's deliverance needed to do on lemon prayers or whatever, he is going to direct you. That's if you want your marriage back and you still maintain that lemon loves you. But my dear, if I am judging with every other thing I have seen online, I need to be real to you. Baby girl, lemon no love you. That's the truth. I would advise you. People are saying call police, call this, call this. If you go police, they will still go, refer you to go to court. This is a court case because you're married legally. There are cases that should be handled in the police or handled in human rights. You know, for me, I don't think human rights should handle this better. Had it been Lemon was maltreating you, Lemon was, you know, hitting you ahead. That was when human rights can come in. But this this is not the case. So I would advise you, advise you to go to court. You married legally, like you claim, and you and we know. So go to court. And go and sue. Since Lemon is not sued. Because if you continue to wait for him, he will not sue you to court. He will not take you to court. He will just keep using you. He's keeping you in the house to be making money. To making his videos. When he wants to talk and make content, he will just find something and make sure that you people are in the parlor. And then he do, does his content. <laughs> he will tell Victor to video you guys anytime you're having issues. And then he does his content. He's making his money. <laughs> and you guys are still there. You wait till 10 years. You wait till eternity. You'll still be there suffering. Go and make a move. See him for bigamy because at this point, what are you even? What are you? What are you waiting for? The, even the sister said she cannot even. The sister to them said she cannot handle. I'll take what you're taking. She would, have, she would have done this before now. So it's not the family members holding you now. Everybody already see what you're going through. So at this point, nobody is going to blame you. There is no blame, any form of blame coming to you. Alice is aware. Everybody is aware. The, how much this guy has pushed you. 
So it's not wickedness. It's just being loving yourself enough and, you know, putting yourself first because your mental health is at stake. Go to court. Everybody is, some are saying you're not the Lego wife. Some are saying they're not the, I'm not here for that. I'm going to do a video on that. But can you, can you stand up? Not because of anybody, because I know the Aris I know does not care about what people say. See, it's about what they want and their happiness. You know, I know. But this time around, you have to do that for your own happiness. You have to go to court. See this guy. Let him understand. It's not about exchanging words with joy. Every day you exchange banters and, and exchange words with lemon. Action speaks louder than what This is the time for action. I am motivating you. I'm gingering you. I am encouraging you to move. When you get to court, this drama will end. They will have to separate you guys. Maybe maybe separate you guys for some time. And then while the process is on, that way, you know, you can move on with your life. You, you can, do you know you can get another man better? See, don't waste your years. You will regret. Don't don't regret. I don't want you to regret. I am talking out of experience. See, when I look back and regret some of the years I spent on people that don't want it, resources, lifetime I spent on people that don't want it, I feel like beating myself. I like I feel like slapping myself. I feel like telling myself, what did you do? Like when you grow, see, when you grow to when you grow in few years to come, you will grow. You will understand what we're saying now. You'll be like, oh, why did I make this mistake? You won't understand it now. Just imagine you're talking to a nursery school child. Yeah, there are some things you'll be telling them. They will not comprehend until they get to a certain age. That's what we are doing for you now. You won't understand. Don't settle for less. You won't understand, girl. Don't settle for less. You are everything. The core Aris I know and I see in you is unique, is industrious, is talented, is gifted, is endowed. You are everything. There is some man out there that will love you. See, this guy wants to finish, wants to rubbish you at the end of the day. When he's done rubbishing, when he's done with you, without making you look, you know, wicked, crazy, look bad in the eyes and, the, in the, you know, where people are, then what's your what? How can you pick the pieces of your life again? At that point, this is the time. You've already wasted a lot of time. You've already made a lot of mistakes being with him. This is the time to move on. This is the time to shine, baby girl. Give yourself two years, girl. You are going to roar. Like, give yourself two years. You're going to soar. Is it soar? Like an eagle. Like, you see yourself there, up there. Like, you say, wow, why have I wasted my years? Lemon is not everything. This is not where love ends. Yes, you have to be real. Be real. Face real life. Like, don't be in, oh, don't leave in denial don't live in fantasies stop this stop this wake up don't be in this dream i used to be like you wake up aris wake up it will not look real now it will look like this is the end of the world lemon is everything lemon is i can't you can't bring with him you can't do this. you can't baby girl a man that will appreciate you and treat you nicely treat you with respect is out there but you have to make the move you have to end this rubbish you have to empty yourself because before you can be filled up you can't be filled up and then be expected to be emptied or be filled up again you have to empty yourself so that you can be filled up hello mary please move there's no need for this exchange of words you're making it look like look so childish this girl joy in question is you know daring you to your face like what can you do bring the police what i am here because lemon is you see what is happening because she is in lemon's camp they are together in this they are using you <laughs> they are together they are just you know trying to do all these things camouflage in, in you know let it be as if they still care they still love you they are together that's why that's where the boldness is coming from because i was wondering where is the boldness coming from how can a side chick have you ever seen a side chick act this way hello they are together in this so the earlier you wake up don't exchange words with them anymore don't go into any kind any form of uh, meeting with them anymore it's time to take action whatever you want to do keep it to yourself and act call out reach out to people talk to people that you need to talk to online they will help you people are willing to help you people are here to help and to reach out stop pining in silence it's time to move it's time to say enough is enough it's gonna be hard it's gonna be hard but you can't but if you th say think you cannot leave your marriage i'm not saying outrightly i'm not telling you what to do and i'm not mandating you or you must leave your marriage. no i'm just advising you i'm just making it look real i'm just bringing everything to your face and i make it allow you to make your decision if you think is what staying for like then go reach out to a man of god and seek the face of god and break the things that need to be bro uh, broken and deliver who needs to be delivered and get your marriage back this is the time I want everybody that come across this video to share this video. Tag Mary. Keep tagging her until she sees this video. Tag her mercilessly. Tag her. She needs to see this. We are not allowing her until she sees this. Tag her uncontrollably until she gets to see this. Like, hmm. So guys, um, what do you have to say concerning this video? Just drop your opinion in the comment section. Thank you so much. And please share. Share. The reason I'm uh, bringing all those videos here is 
for her to see the video end also maybe listing she might listing if she always gets the notification and she is always getting those videos she might click on one one very day so that she can also listen that girl is going through a whole lot all right thank you so much guys for watching my video please don't forget to like comment share and to my all subscribers thank you so 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 much my new subscribers thank you so 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 much i really appreciate god richly bless you all and if you know you have not subscribed to my channel what are you waiting for please subscribe please okay guys thank you god bless you we'll see you in the next one bye for now